What's up, everyone? How's everyone doing? It's RC Poetic. So, figured that I would uh, take a drink before I get started. But, um, how's everybody doing out there? Hopefully good. Um, please take a second and like the channel. I would really appreciate it if you did. It would be great. You know, I'm trying to build here um, on my channel. And I'm, what I'm here to talk to you guys about is Taylor Swift, who is one of my favorite artists. It's, it's her and Rihanna when it comes to terms of singers, um, female singers. It's definitely Taylor Swift 1A and Rihanna 1A. Um, I was looking, I'm looking forward to a new Rihanna material um, more than anything out of artists this year. But um, Taylor Swift decided to come, come back first. So, um, of course, there's no competition. It's just two artists that I like and they put out music when they do. Um, so I heard the new song by Taylor is called Me, and it's featuring uh, one of the band members of Panic, Panic, um, Panic at the Disco. Um, I do like rock all time, all all types. I'm not a hundred percent familiar with Panic at the Disco. I probably heard some of their songs because um, I'm I'm a musical kind of sir. I get all over the place in terms of genres. But anyway, getting back to um, the main topic at hand. And um, I hope I said subscribe, guys. Please like and subscribe. But if I didn't, can you please do that for me? But getting back to T Swift, and yes, Taylor Swift does have African American fans. So let's not get all brand new. If if some people do, um, I, I only say that because um, you would be surprised what I've heard. Um, I've, I've been um, well received for it and people who say, why do you like her? And I'm like, Ugh. just understand, I like her talent. I like her music. It has nothing to do with color at all. Nothing to do with color. Um, I listen to all kind of artists, German artists, American artists, uh, African American artists, uh, Asian artists. Japanese, every I listen to everything. Caucasian artists, so no, that's silly. Only, only in the black community, do people like to limit something or restrict or refrain. But I'm not going to go down that path. That's not what this is about. I'm here to talk to y'all about Taylor Swift' new song called "Me," and I played it like I say about four times, guys. And here is the um artwork for that single. Um, me and I need to get my uh, my cover, my case for this. But anyway, that's me. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. New song by Taylor Swift and my first impression. My first impression of the um song is is pretty damn good, but I haven't heard it in the car yet, so I don't know where I really judge it at because that's what matters when I listen to it in the vehicle, but. I would probably give it out the gate. I'd probably give this song an 8 out of 10. And I, I try to always be unbiased regardless if it's a favorite. Um, like I say, I heard it four times. I'm going to sit with it. I, I love the album 1989 by Taylor Swift. I enjoy Reputation. Um, I really like Red. Notice I love 1989. I enjoy Reputation, and I like Red, cause those are when I became a T Swift fan. It started with Red, um, and then it picked up. But this new song, the one I should be concentrating on, like I say, I like it, but I don't know if I'm in love with it. But I need to continue to hear it, and I'm gonna listen to it in the car. Like I say, I really. I really just want some new material from Rihanna. That's who I really wanted it from. But Taylor Swift, they won A and won A. So, if, because it's, it's definitely pop. If you um like, like, clean, fun, Taylor, which most people do, I think you'll like this song. The Reputation album was kind of dark at, at, at spots, but it also had highs. I don't know. I don't know, man. It just seems like 
because a lot of people try to tear her down for that album, but it just seems like a lot of people just don't want to see, in general, someone be successful for a long period of time. Um, and that's just hate, but also it's not stopping anything. You know, it's not. When one, I'm one big, uh, what did I say? I'm just one big ray uh, of uh, sun, uh, freaking uh, sunshine. Ray of sunshine. I'm just one big freaking ray of sunshine. I had to read off to my shirt, but that also means that um, how I see it in terms of optimism, that no matter what people do, no matter how they hate on you, you just one big ray of sunshine. You just, you're going to shine. You're going to illuminate. Um, believe that. Um, I want to get into so much uh, more myself in terms of just uplifting and positivity. But as I um, bring this once again back to Taylor Swift's song, Me, um, very fun, very light. Um, I wonder if that's going to be the turn of the new album. Um, like I say, she is an incredible artist. I enjoy her thoroughly. And I look forward to getting into this song some more. But I am glad she's back. But I really want Rihanna to come back. But um, T-Swift is one of my favorite artists. And that's not going to change anytime soon. As long as she keeps putting good workout, great workout. Um, so, yeah. Definitely I could see myself playing this. And I may come back with a second review after I hear this in the car a couple times. Um, I try to be honest, favorite singer or not, I don't try to wear blinding glasses towards the artist. I try to um, always see, you know, the full spectrum. You know, don't just, I'm not going to come on here and be like, yeah, is this the most amazing song? It's not the video for that. I'm not that um, YouTuber that's going to be like, oh my God, this is where, you know, it has, to, it could be my favorite artist, but it has to be great work as well and i like this enough that it's a eight possibly 7.5 we'll see how it goes um as the days come i thank y'all for watching poetic soul signing out peace